Okay, so we're going to change our oil. That's our new oil filter. It's a Honda filter. And uh, so we're going to start with that. Get under the car here. Okay. Let me get in position. Okay, there's our oil filter. It's not going to focus well, but... Uh, blue filter right there. There's going to be room to reach up and around this black bar without um, taking off any covers or anything. So we're going to start with that. Okay, well most Hondas you can use this Honda oil filter wrench, but on this, by the time you put a socket in there, you don't have clearance. So I'm using this style of filter wrench for for it. Um, there's the range and size that works on this. So we get something like that. We're gonna get that oil filter changed. Okay, there's where our oil filter came off from. Put our new one on. I'm going to do that now. I'm going to need two hands. Then we're going to drain our oil. Okay, so I have this Famoto valve to drain the oil. So all I have to do is get my, my oil pan right under there. And then I push in on the spring loaded lever. Turn it 90 degrees. Let the oil drain. you don't know about the Fumoto valves, it's F-U-M-O-T-O, -O, and you it prevents you from having to take out your drain bolt and put it in. All you have to do once you install it is what I just showed you, and then after that oil's drained, we'll push in on the spring-loaded uh, valve and just rotate it 90 degrees, and it'll be closed. So we're going to let the oil drain. Then we'll put in our oil, which is 5.7 quarts. And that's going to complete our oil change. 